I was just there. I was just there. I should have stayed. You should have. You, can Trevor, try. you see this? It says 2020. We need one that says 2021. You gonna help us? Yeah, I know. I'm watching that video. I'm jealous I wasn't there. I want to be a part of it. So we gotta do it again. Yeah. Well, there's nothing to do in Cincinnati. I can tell you that. So there's gonna be a lot of nightlife. In fact, I met James Loney. If James Loney's on. I got him into a Timberland private, like, I don't know what it was, 12 years ago. And he's like, I love LA. And then we, then he got shipped off the Tampa Bay. So we got to keep you back in your home, okay? And we are so excited. Cy Young Award winner. Magic, what do you got to say about, about our boy here? It's past 6.30. He you know, might not be on. <laughs> yeah, Trevor, he's not on you. Dave, what do you got? I'm gonna let Magic speak. Magic's off mute right now. Magic? Are there now? You hear me? There we yeah. go. No, I'm just, I, I called Trevor and I told him welcome to the Dodgers. I know he, he is amazing competitor, great pitcher, and uh, he's gonna do some great things working with Dave and the team. And uh, sometimes when you go to repeat, you need somebody new to keep everybody on edge, somebody who hadn't won a championship. So Trevor's job is to keep everybody on edge and, and, and make sure they're doing their job just like he's going to do his job. And we got some great leaders in the clubhouse. I, 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 I couldn't be so more happier to, when you think about uh, Clayton Kershaw, tremendous man, but also what Clayton does off the field too, him and his wife all the work they do in Africa and other places as well. So, uh, Trevor, listen, all you got to do is just do your part, brother, because we got everybody else doing their part, and that's how we won this year, and that's how we're going to win, uh, I should say, last season, and that's how we're going to win this season as well. And then Cookie and I are going to give 50000 We're going to kick it off with 50000 And so uh, let's get this thing rolling, right? So uh, uh, Nicole, Cookie, and I got 50. Thank you, Magic. Thank you, Magic. Thank you, Cookie. Hey, Magic. Thank you, Cookie. Thank you. Guys, for the first time, one, thank you guys for such a generous donation. That uh, in itself is providing so many meals. But for the first time ever, I am not sending the donation link in the chat, but there is someone else. But, you know, Corey is just, he's the MVP. What, what else can you say? He's the MVP. <laughs> um, yeah, you know, we're just, we're super appreciative of everybody's support. You know, we knew you guys were watching. We knew you guys were at home to us on. Even when you guys couldn't be there, you know, we felt that love. We we know what our fans are about and what they, and how they support us and stuff like that. So, you know, we just, we're just happy to give this to you guys finally. You know, it, it's a long time coming. We've been there so close, but just to finally be able to give it back to you guys was awesome. It was, it was a true blast. We no, Corey, want to congratulate that's... both of you and just on an amazing season as well. So two congratulations. Oh no, my dad exited out of Zoom. Uh, <laughs> watching. We're on a we're on a we're on my brother's phone. He he's really popular right Corey, now. Corey, look where we are. We're right here where you should be. We're sitting yeah, right here to go. say something. <laughs> I enjoyed that. I gotta come down to the studio and watch you guys. I'm I'm here in Nashville too. Oh dude, come on. We're right here, let's go. I, I, I've been over to Big Loud. That's where I, uh, Ernest, me and Ernest are really good friends. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah. I'm Ernest. sure you know Ernest. One of the most talented <laughs> cats out there right now. He's crazy. And, yeah, I, I was, uh, I go to the studio with him, you know, every now and then and uh, let, let, listen to him write and lay down some tracks. So, so yes. Yeah. We know what I'm Okay, so hey, Mookie can bowl. He's bowled 300 games. He can dunk. He can shoot threes from NBA range like nothing. I want to see him lay down a track and like pick it on a guitar or something like that. I, I, I know my limits. <laughs> Mookie, we wanted Snoop. We were trying to get him. I should have I should have hit you up to try to get him out of here. It would have been amazing for him to come out. But he congratulations. Probably, yeah. he, he probably didn't want to talk to me because I beat him in a three-point contest. <laughs> That's fair. So, Mookie, <laughs> I got to say, I see Max Bunce. He's getting excited. Will Smith's ready. You guys know what this is, right? This is on tequila. Actually, this is on our quarantine bottle, but I gotta have a toast to my you dad, guys. My dad got here before me and he made us bring it here today. I was like, are you seriously gonna do this bit? But yeah, we're doing not, it. Not, not for Demi, only for me. I gotta thank my friends from Diageo because they're incredible and have been great fans of, of quarantunes. And this is for the Dodgers, a little tequila. Dan, Shay, you guys ready to toast to everybody? Whatever you guys have, Max, 
Will, Corey, Cody, everybody else I see on there. And if I if I toast you, we got to have a song appropriate. Hi. I think it's very appropriate. Dan actually literally went to go get two classes in uh, a bottle of 1542 because we'd be not involved in this. Is that the... Not on. Tracy Gilbert, shout out to you. No, it's not Thank there. Thank you. I also just want to say that I'm looking here. Dan just got this out of his pantry, and it says, it says, I'm bringing a shame. <laughs> this guy's been home by tequila hostage. This is unbelievable. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. They're sitting in his house. That's the music biz. That's the music biz, baby. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. All right, so we got our glasses here. So I'm oh, yeah. just going to for this time right now, Bob. If you're legal, get your tequila out. <laughs> Mookie's like, where's the tequila? Where's the tequila? <laughs> I just I just finished hitting, so I don't and have to. And then donate to the Allen Regional Food Bank. And we're going to get to raising money in a second. And guess what, Mookie? I know you have a World Series ring coming to you. I just got word from Lon Rosen that we're going to auction off the only outside the organization Dodger ring. So you guys better get your checkbook ready. We're going to do that soon. But here's the tequila. Here's to the world champion Dodgers. Congratulations. In front of almost a thousand people tonight. Um, but I am so happy that we are gathered in this way, the only way that we can right now. As the 2020 ESPN Humanitarian Team of the Year, the Dodgers Foundation is tackling the most pressing problems facing Los Angeles with a mission to improve education, homelessness, healthcare, and social justice for all Angelinos. To date, we have invested more than 32 million in our programs and literally grants to nonprofit organizations, including $23 million of that in the last seven years alone. This past year, we all know it's been full of physical and emotional strain. We've been drenched in all this uncertainty. Our endurance is tested, but the Dodgers Foundation decided that we were going to continue to show up for the community no matter what. 